Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we have one very important game. It is the Caribou Cup final against Manchester City, a team that we've beaten twice in recent history. The only thing to say about it is they were both at home. <laughs> Welcome to episode 37 of Making Chelsea Stand Proud. My name's Mark, and on today's episode, we have that Caribou Cup final, the one that we won last year. Um, this year, we're playing Manchester City. Uh, last year, I can, do you know, I can't remember, and I know we did look at it, and I did think it was one team. I think I, at one point, I thought it was Arsenal, and it wasn't. So we're going to have a look at that in just a moment. Um, but to, uh, to say... Uh, as I mentioned in the intro, uh, we have played Manchester City recently on uh, two occasions. Uh, or in fact, played them three times just recently. There we go. Um, past history, uh, beat them 3-0 uh, last time out, 5-2 the time before that, and 2-0 at the start of the season. Uh, so we've beaten three times this season already, and the previous to that were two 1-1 draws. So we haven't lost to them in five games. Um, having said that, we have uh, played them three times at home and twice away. So who knows? This is neutral ground. Anything may happen in this particular uh, game. Um, but having said all of that, it is extremely interesting to uh, to see that it's Wednesday night, which uh, I think, as we said in real life, I don't think it would happen. I think it would go ahead on a Sunday. Um, yes, we were going to have a look, weren't we, at, uh, at last season. So I've got to be careful because this has caused me some manner of problems. Uh, there we go. It's not going to cause me problems today. Last season, uh, Caribou Cup final. Where are we? Na, na, na. FA Cup final. EFL semi-final, EFL cup final, there you go. It was against Brentford. So we beat Brentford in the final last season by two goals to one extra time in that match. Um, it was uh, Raheem Sterling getting the opening goal. Uh, Pontus Janssen after 78 minutes equalising on Wesley Fofana, Fofana, presumably from a corner. Um, let's just double check. Um who got the winning goal after 112 minutes. Let's hope it doesn't go to extra time tonight. Uh, it'd be good to finish them off in normal time, or they finish us off, I guess, is, is where it's going. Well, it wasn't a corner. It was actually from a free kick, Zayic. Whatever happened to Zayic? Um, so, yes, uh, that, that was how we won the um, Caribou Cup last season. So, defending champions and... Uh, we can go back now to this season. There we go. Um, yeah, defending champions. And as uh, we've already said, played them uh, a few times just recently. So familiar foe, uh, say to speak. And in fact, we uh, met them just literally in the last game, the fifth round of the FA Cup, uh, where we beat them uh, quite comprehensively. 3-0, Kai Havitz, two goals, and a bang -a -mang, uh finishing them off after 90 minutes after coming on as a substitute. Right, we're going to get on with the game. We're going to get on with the episode. And it's going to be a trip to Wembley. My apologies, I pressed the wrong button there. If it was a bit of a blip, um, I was getting ahead of myself. Um, yes, a trip to Wembley. And uh, we'll have a look at the team that will face Manchester City for this Caribou Cup final. And this is the team that will face Manchester City in this final. Uh, Mendy in goal has had been in uh, reasonable form in the last couple of games. Uh, Chilwell, Rice, Fafana, and James. Our defensive line, uh, Jorginho and Kante, are in front of them. Pulsic, Mount, and Hudson Odoi 
are behind Havitz, who's up front. Rice is in for the suspended Garcia. And on the bench, we have Azapakweta, Kepa. Uh, sorry, Azapakweta? No, it was Kepa. Um, Kulabai, Kovacic, Barboza, Azapakweta, as previously mentioned, Andurin, Broja, Kukarela, and Raheem Sterling, who's coming back from injury, um, can only play 45 minutes. Hence, why, as you know, I don't like playing a player if I know I'm going to have to bring him off at half time. I'd rather him come on as a substitute. So uh, Pulsic gets the nod in front of Sterling for this one. And this is how the teams line up. Manchester City playing in their 4-3-3 formation. Making three changes. De Bruyne, one of those changes. And for Manchester City, the Chelsea team rather. Coming up on screen. And we have a kickoff. We've got, we're on extended, well, not extended, but uh, yeah, comprehensive. No, extended highlights. So we will see the kickoff. And Chilwell comes forward looking for that way. They're very Bafana cutting that uh, Haaland run out. Hudson Adoy losing out though, and he's won it back. James Bafana. Rice, Chilwell, Chilwell comes forward. Pulsic into the area, has crossed it in the six-yard box. Nobody there to meet it, though. And we've still got the ball. The store, ball's still alive. Chilwell firing that over the top. Stefan with the goal kick. Laporte, Ruben, got a hand. Have it. Finds Mount, finds hudson Adoy, And I think he was offside. Oh, with a free kick, De Bruyne, Rodrigo, Mount comes back and tidies up, Rice, Fafana, James comes forward, it's gone for hudson Adoy. hudson Adoy's lost the ball, lost that two or three times, won it back previously, didn't this time, looking for Haaland, it's cut out Jorginho, Mount loses the ball, De Bruyne's on it, and Bernardo Silva crosses the ball for De Bruyne, Looking to get that to Haaland. Didn't get there, though, and uh, the shot did come in, and Mendy saved it. Stefan with the goal kick again. Laporte, De Bruyne. Laporte and De Bruyne playing a 1-2. On all the way back to Stefan. James gets underneath that. Kante looking for Pulsic. Didn't find him. Jorginho's there, though. Finds Chilwell. Chilwell. Pulsic again. Good passage of play. Pulsic crossed field. Hudson Adoy. Kante couldn't get a shot away. James fires it back across. Pulsic is there. Come back for Chilwell. Chilwell to Pulsic. Pulsic, and that's deflected over the top from Diaz. Uh, well blocked, and a corner ensues. Chilwell with the corner. An in swinger. It's cleared up field, and uh, Hudson Adoy gets there ahead of Cancelo. Rodrigo, Ruben. More even match than we've had just recently against them. A Walker's got plenty of room. What's going on here? And puts it away. Carl Walker, his second goal of the season. And the first time we've been behind against them in three matches. And uh, now's not the time to do it. 20 minutes on the clock. And we go that goal behind. Squeezed it between Mendy and the near post. Free kick from just inside their half. Laporte, Cancelo, through to Haaland. Need to try and get back on terms soon as. That was won by hudson Adoy, I think, but uh, very quickly lost it again. Cancelo, back to Laporte, Rodrigo. Cancelo comes forward and hudson Adoy wins that ball. Mount. James, who's picked up a yellow card somewhere along the line. Hudson Adoy for Farner. Jorginho finds Havertz, who pulls a save out of Stefan and uh, into touch. Stefan with a goal kick. Ruben, Rodrigo, Laporte, De Bruyne. Long one wide for Bernardo Silva, looking for Yao Felix. Well, that's blocked. Rice for Farner, Mount. Half time comes. It's been a half 
where we've not done badly, but uh, we've just not managed to put our chances away. We've had six shots, two on target, 0.54 on the XG. 39% of the possession, which is the story of the last few matches against them. Um, they've had three shots, two on target, 0.53, 61% uh, of the possession. Uh, they've just put away their chance where we haven't been able to. Otherwise, it's pretty much even Stevens. It's been a bit of a topsy-turvy game, as you will see. Um, we were in the ascendancy, then they came back, scored the goal, um, and then we've worked our way back into the game. Uh, good end to the, set, to the first half. Need to uh, see if we can get that goal back early in the second half. And we kick off the second half. Foden is on for Silva. And uh, actually, before we do anything else, we need to set up the opposition instructions for him. If Bernard, uh, if Phil Foden is on. That. that one change Jorginho ball forward looking for Hudson Adoy been headed into touch 59 minutes on the clock for this highlight and we've not made an in road yet moving the ball around nicely Yao Felix picked up a yellow card so is Rodrigo they're looking for a way through at the moment. We need to get that ball back sooner than later. And Hudson Nadoy has done it. Can we get something from here? Pulsic. It's gone through to Mason Mount, who's got it in the back of the net. The equaliser. 23rd goal of the season from Mason Mount. It's 1 1 with 61 minutes on the clock. It was coming. Could feel it slowly edging. And Ruben made a mistake. Cleared the ball from, uh, I think it was Habits. Yeah, cleared the ball out of the way of Habits, but Mason Mount was standing there, and all he had to do was chip the goalkeeper. Chilwell with the throw in. Pulsic. Pulsic crosses into the area, and uh, Jorginho's brought down. Claims for a penalty, nothing given, and we carry on. Mount crossed into the area. It's uh, Pulsic getting to the ball. I'm winning it, but uh, going the wrong way, really. Swings it out to Cancelo on that far side. Always dangerous when they come forward. Grealish is in there. Space, Godjanen, and he's hit that over. Or oh, Godahan. It's gone out for a corner. Was deflected, obviously. De Bruyne with the corner. Swings it in. It's clear, but only as far as Cancelo. And uh, De Bruyne couldn't touch it because he was offside. And we're going to make three changes. Uh, Hudson Adoy is off for Broja on the right hand side. Ben Chilwell comes off for Kukurela. And Christian Pulsic, he's off for Raheem Sterling. And uh, we're looking for somebody to pull something out of the bag. It's 1 1 with 75 minutes on the clock. We have a corner. Mason Mount with the corner. Can we get something from this? It's. Uh, to the near post, and it was uh, blocked. Have it. Can't take. Mount. Cross it into the area, but it's flicked away. Jorginho adds it back in. Have it. Had a bite of the cherry, and it didn't go through. Corner on this side now. Mount. Fires it in. Low and hard. It's gone in. Wesley for Fana, and it's gone for on in off of Stefan. And we do take the lead after 85 minutes. Mount. Fana heads it straight at Stefan. And it, I don't know, it's so hard, he couldn't hold it. Four minutes of injury time. Mendy fires this one forward. Brozier is underneath it. Brozier keeps hold of it. He's gone out wide for Sterling. Sterling still on the ball. He's new on the pitch, and it's cleared by Mourinho out for a corner. Mason Mount comes across for this corner. Can we get another one? This will finish it off if we can. For Fana on this near post. Mount crossed in. It's cleared upfield. Kovacic should have been there, but didn't. Grealish gets it. And Cucurella gets underneath it. And we are virtually on time. Mendy to Rice. Rice finds Fafana. Kovacic, don't do anything silly here. Mount, Mount looking for Habits, but Habits is tired. He's not got the legs. And Stefan will clear this upfield. Brozier is there, though. 
And we have won the Caribou Cup, boys and girls. We have retained the cup, beating Manchester City for the fourth time in a row. And what a turnaround, a goal down. And we've come back to win it 2-1 in full time. And there it is. What a good win that is. Absolutely spectacular. Who's going to do the cartwheel? Anybody? There we go. Number nine. Habits is, I think. And there it is. We have won the Caribou Cup. For the second time, Mason Mount. Mason Mount, a player of the match game. One goal, one assist, and two key. Didn't really want to take him off, even though he uh, probably should have come off at the end there, but we were that close. And, uh, well, there we go. Raheem Sterling get a 7.1 having come on. And uh, absolutely splendid for Farner. Having a great game as well at the back. Mendy probably not having such a good game, but really only that one mistake for Carl Walker on his near post, which he should have saved realistically. And uh, once again, we have stopped that goal machine from doing anything that is remotely dangerous. And uh, well, what can I say? And confirmation of that win on a wet evening at Wembley. Chelsea had the honour of lifting the EFL Cup for Chelsea's 2-1 victory over Manchester City. Chelsea made it consecutive victories against Manchester City in the 2-1 win. Outstanding fullback Carl Walker gave Manchester City the lead. Definitely executed finish from close range in 20 minutes. Advanced playmaker Mason Mount then equalised for Chelsea on 61 with a delicate chip. And ball-playing defender Wesley Fofana clinched a late winner 86 minutes with a mighty header from within the six-yard box. Fofana's impact delighted the fans with his late goal. We qualify for the uh, Europa Conference League, but we're uh, looking at bigger and better things um, at uh, that. And, uh, well, we'll, uh, we'll leave all those bits to do in between the games. Um, but we have retained the Caribou Cup for the second season in a row. Good news that was after uh, our uh, run. We'll uh, have a look at that at some other point, I think. Um, we're going to come back. For our next episode, it would be playing Barcelona uh, in the Champions League. 1-1 after the first leg. But of course, we're in Barcelona for the return leg. And uh, then a, a local derby against Tottenham um, in the Premier League. And where we need to keep going in the Premier League because uh, as it currently stands, uh, we are at the top, uh, as you'll see, 10 points behind the team that we've just played. Uh, uh, but we are eight points clear of Arsenal. And uh, in second, in third place, Liverpool in fourth place. So we are uh, nine points in front of them at the moment. They both have a game in hand, though. So uh, maybe they might come back to haunt us a little bit. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, back for those. So Norwich, we're going to play offline. We'll be back for those uh, for those games uh, in the next episode. Well, I hope you've enjoyed today's episode. You can't not have enjoyed it. Um, if you have, then please leave me that big thumbs up, subscribe and hit the notification button. That will keep you up to date with all future episodes of this and new series as they are released. Uh, new episodes of Making Chelsea Stand Proud currently released every uh, Tuesday and Friday at 4.15pm. And what a great way to end the week, eh? Uh, if you want to keep up to date what's happening on this channel and more, then you need to follow me on Twitter at Just Offside 2. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you for the next episode. It'll be episode 38. It's out on Monday. Until then, I wish you a very good weekend. Bye-bye.